UFC 278 was headlined by a rematch between UFC welterweight champion Kamaru Usman and title challenger Leon Edwards. The pair first fought back in 2015, with Leon Edwards out for redemption to not only correct his past loss to Usman, but to capture the title and take out the number one pound for pound. The first round got underway and in a minute and a half in, Usman looked for the takedown up against the cage. Edwards defended well at first, but then found himself on his back, with Usman landing vicious elbows from the top. He returned to his feet, fighting off the grip of Usman. He got the underhooks and used the leg trip to take the champion down to the mat. This being the first time Usman had been taken down in his 16 UFC fights. Edwards got full mount, took the champ's back and tied him up in a body triangle with hopes of finishing the champ. But he was unable to get under the chin. Usman pressured Edwards in round two, unloading with a series of heavy shots up against the cage. He continued to press forward, and with a minute and a half left, Edwards shot for a takedown. The champ sprawled and took control of Edwards, returning to their feet, where Usman continued to press Edwards against the fence to unload with vicious shots to the face and body. The champ then finished the round with a takedown. The champ continued to apply pressure in rounds three and four pressing Edwards up against the fence and controlling him in the clinch, landing takedowns and unloading with combinations and big shots on the feet. Edwards began to turn things around in the final minutes of the fifth and final round. With just under one minute to go, Edwards set up a perfectly timed head kick that connected and sent the champion Kamara Usman straight down to the canvas. The knockout finish came at 4 minutes 4 seconds into the final round. Leon Edwards now becomes the first Jamaican-born UFC champion and second UFC fighter to bring the title back to the UK. What did you think of that outcome? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe to MMA Crazy and turn on notifications to stay up to date on all the latest news.